First thing I wanted to say was it was about time that y'all got married. I mean, they knew each other since they were kids. And there's proof right there in that little picture right there in that cake. <laughs> um, you know, just one thing with Farley, he's just, I mean, he's a good friend, but he's just not just a friend, but it's my brother-in-law. I love you, both of you guys, and just thank you for everything. And let's enjoy the night. Thank you. Farley, you were just about as chunky as I was back in the day, and Chanel, it took me three years to remember how to spell your name right, you know, but those were the good days, you know, and, you know, our friendship was almost instantaneous, and I'll always be grateful for that. There are not enough words to describe to be able to thank you both for the friendships that you guys have given me over the years. In a world where most friendships solely rely on what you bring to the table, you two are the only people who really care about the people who actually surround that table. And I'll never be able to thank you enough for that. To the two people who can't bear to spend a single minute away from each other, may you never have to again. Cheers. Um, but when Chanel started dating Farley, I, I knew it was different. Um, she really, he really seemed to get her in a way that many just didn't. And it's been so much fun to watch them grow and change into the couple that they are today. And I am so excited that I get a front row seat to the next adventure. There was a day that I needed Chanel the most, but she was in Nebraska. And Farley showed up for me instead. And ever since that day, I knew he was the one for Chanel. so very blessed that we are in this night to celebrate both of your union finally because since you were kindergarten you've known each other and then you found each other again don't know how how it happened I guess it's meant to be <laughs> <laughs> 